In this video, we're going to look at how to reshape an array, how to stack uh, an array, splitting an array, and lastly, how to flatten an array. First, import the NumPy array, uh, click run. Uh, to reshape an array, first of all, we create an array of uh, nine elements, and we call that S. And then we, we uh, use S dot notation to reshape this into a three by three matrix or array, meaning that we need to have or populate these numbers into a three by three uh, array, three rows and three columns. And now we call it T. So when we run this, you can see these numbers uh, or these values have been populated into a three by three array. Now, stacking here is a very useful uh, feature in NumPy is used to join multiple NumPy arrays. So in this case, we create two arrays. Uh, first of all, they must have the same shape and dimension for you to perform stacking. So here you can see uh, array U is made up of uh, one dimension. V is also one dimensional array. So we now use np.stack. We access this stack function. Okay, and we now pass it as a tuple. Okay, UV. Remember, uh, two arrays here. And then we want to um, stack them along axis zero. Axis zero here means we want to stack them along the rows. Okay, so once we print this out, you can see here we just stack them on top of each other. One, two, three, four, five, six. So if we want to chain this and stack them along the column, we just chain this axis to one. You can see here, we're just stacking one, uh, you know, we just stack along the column. So essentially here, this, these rows will just be columns, one, two, three, and then these rows will be along the column. Then also, if you want to split an array, first we create our array, call that X, then we use the split uh, function here, and then we pass our array and we define how we want to split that. So here we just indicate the position where we want to split. So here, we want to split at position three. So be zero, one, two, three, and then split here, and then position six again, four, five, six, and then split it again. So we print that, you can see here. So after zero, one, two, three, we split that, that's what we have. And then we split again at position six. Um, so we can change this maybe to one. We want to split it at zero, one. So essentially we have one, two, then at position six. So just do automatically that. So remember there are other different functions of how to split that along X axis, along, uh, you can specify zero or one and can read more about this uh, in the documentation. And lastly here, this is a very important uh, section or very powerful section in, in NumPy, especially if you go into machine learning and deep learning, most times you might need to flatten your pixels, right? If you are trying to perform classification uh, problem and you want to import maybe images for cats and dogs or medical images, sometimes these are very good for uh, converting these uh, n-dimensional arrays and flatten them into a one-dimensional array uh, for faster computation. So again, here we have our array called Z, and then we use this flatten function to convert all this into one-dimensional uh, array and call it A. And you can see here, we flatten this into one dimensional array. So in summary here, we've seen how to reshape uh, an array. We've seen how to stack array along this X axis, rather axis zero for row wise and axis one for column wise. We've seen how to split based on the integer position. And last we've seen how to flatten uh, uh, a 2D array to a 1D array.